Okay, so today I'll be doing another tutorial, but this time it's not like a nail related video. It's actually going to be a, about beading. So, let me see. It's kind of hard to fit things in the screen, but here I just have a bead container or a bead storage um, thing. And uh, we'll be using this. Oh, yeah, I forgot to mention what we're doing. Okay, we're making earrings today. So, it's pretty easy to do once you get the hang of it, and you can be very creative with this, so that's what I love. Here are just a couple more beads that we'll be using. Um, you'll need some earring hooks, like the empty ones, and then you'll also need some head pins. Um, and then I just have a little bit more of different beads that we could use. And then this big container here contains a few tools. By the way, this is what the earrings could possibly look like. Let's see if that will focus. Yeah, that's what they, um, like, we'll play around with different designs and see what we like. But I don't want this video to be too super long, so we'll probably only make one earring. Here are these, um, I forget what they're called. They're not round nose pliers, but they're more flat. And the opening is flat. These are wire clippers, and these ones are by the Beadsmith. These are really good quality um, wire clippers. I like these ones. And then there are just some regular good old round nose pliers, and these will be very important. Um, something that you don't really need but would be helpful is like a beading triangle like this. And also, I'm working on glass today, so you'll want like a bead mat or a bead landing like this one. One says bead landing right there. Oh, wait, no, it says it right there. Okay, I'm making mess. Let's just um, continue on. So I'm going to put down this mat. Okay. And you're going to need some head pins. So let's go ahead and do this. Um, today, let's go silver. Um, this is an eye pin. We're looking for head pins. Okay, so we'll just make one earring for now. Um, but you'll also need one of these. Stuck together. Alrighty. Um, sorry, I'm kind of in a rush because I, want, I don't want this video to take very long, but I want to be thorough. So then um, you need a filler. And for those of you who aren't familiar with beading, let me go ahead and pull out a filler to show you guys what it looks like. So here's my stack of like fillers. You could use like the rounded type, or there's these little ones that look like flowers. Today we'll be using the flower ones. Sorry, really close. Um, so let's see. I'm just going to take out two silver ones. Um, okay, so once you have that, then you want to take out um, two silver ones of the rounded ones. And if you don't have these exact um, products or beads, then there, by no means do you have to go out and buy them, because you can work with what you have. So, um, this is what we have so far. So go ahead and start stringing on the filler, the flower shaped one, onto your um, head pin. So sorry, it's kind of hard to see because um, I have to look through the camera screen. But okay, um, so let's find some cute uh, beads. Here I just have some Swarovski crystals, and um, I really like these for beading because they just like really uh, make things a lot prettier. So let me just see. We could use actually, you know what? These ones are kind of more like bright colors, and I'm gonna go for the pastel ones. So I have some pastel ones in this container. Alright, so let me just pull some of these out. Let's see, we'll go with this like really pretty purple color. So we just need one for now. 
that's what it looks like. And again, it's pretty hard to film a beading video when, you know, there's a big vase here. <laughs> but it's what supports my camera, so that's why it's always there. So this is just going to be a basic um, beading tutorial, or beading, well, it's going to be a basic earring because I don't want it to be too complicated because, again, I'm on a time crunch here. But just, um, I put on the Sorsky crystal and now I'm putting on the top bead. Um, these ones uh, that I showed you earlier in the video, they have two Sorskis. They have a red one, and then they have a, um, a clear crystal one. But I put a rondelle in between, and then I put the two fillers here and there, and then the big um, round one. But for here, it's just going to be very simple. So let me zoom out so you guys can see this. Alright, so what you're going to do is you're going to take your round nose pliers, and you're just going to take it and bend it like that. Then grab right here, it's just, just a couple, like a centimeter away, and bend in the opposite direction so that it kind of looks like um, an earring hook, like that. You see how that kind of resembles? Okay, and I don't want to zoom too in. <laughs> Sorry, that's my dog. He's my puppy, Kato. Anyways, you're going to take this, and you're going to swing it behind. Oh my goodness, Kato. So once you have swinged it behind like that, you can go ahead and start wrapping it around. So I just um, stick in my pliers like that. Take this tool right there. And you're just going to um, start to wrap the tail of the head pin around to the excess area. Um, let me focus the camera. Um, to the excess area that's right in between there. So, I'll just go ahead and do that. Sorry about the camera not focusing. Um, this is a different camera. Oh my gosh. Okay, so once you've had that, that's what it will look like. So then you can cut off the excess tail. And make sure when you do this not to point it up like this at yourself. Point it down towards the mat. And there you go. So there will still be a rough edge, kind of. Can see that so just take it and spin it around clamp it down all that stuff and then you want to work out your eye pin usually it take a while on that but I'll just shorten the video now we're um, towards the end just take this um, oops sorry you want to open it up oh wrong side sorry everybody Okay, I'm running into problems with this. Just open it up like that. Put this on. Close it up. And there you have it. There is your really pretty earring. So it was pretty simple. Sorry this video was so rushed, but I just have to do it under 10 minutes if I want to upload it. So there you go. I think this earring is so pretty. Um, if you have any questions, I know beading is kind of a hard concept at first to learn, but then once you get a hang of it, it's definitely fun. So thank you guys so much for watching. Um, I hope you enjoyed the video. Bye!